Yo, what's going on guys? Arax here and welcome back to more Hitman Beta. So firstly, thank you very much for all the support you showed the last episode. A lot of you guys said, can I do some more of this? So that is exactly what I'm doing. The first episode, in case you guys haven't seen it, is like a training mission. Runs you through a contract where you basically have to eliminate a target in the training facility on a boat. And you have to like do it exactly as the game tells you. But after that, you're given some freedom to then go back and do it a different way. I then did some of those methods on stream. However, you then get the second mission in an airfield, which is what we're going to do in this one. And again, there are a variety of different ways we can do it. And we're going to do a pretty interesting way. We're going to like find or use a pretty interesting way to kill the target. So I'm going to jump over here to the final test and let's get started. The final test is based on an authentic 1979 mission. The high point of training director Soda's career as an active agent. The target was Jasper Knight, a famous US chess master exposed as a Soviet spy. Soda's caught up with Knight at a military airfield in Cuba and eliminated him against all odds. This is your objective as well. Now listen carefully. ICA exams aren't normally this difficult. Not only was the airfield a virtual fortress, he even added additional guards. Soda's wants you to fail. He considers you a threat, and this way, your unfortunate exit from the program will not raise any eyebrows. He did not, however, factor me into the equation. If Sodas can bend the rules, then so can I. Good luck, Initiate. Alright, okay, let's do this. So, I have actually done this, I did this on stream. So I'm going to show you guys sort of like a more advanced walkthrough than just say me saying, hey, let's work out how, this, how to do this. So what we're going to do is, if we bring up the menu, we go across to the challenges section, you see, there are different ways you can assassinate them. So, for example, you've got Silent Assassin, you've got to assassinate Jasper Knight, only killing the targets, hiding all the bodies and not getting spotted. However, you've got additional options like mechanical solutions, assassinate him with a or like with an accident while disguised as a mechanic. And this is the one we're going to go after. I'm not going to show you exactly or tell you exactly what happens just yet, but scroll through. There's, of course, the options you saw in the previous one. So things like I can electrocute him with a projector, can drown him in the toilet, um, you know, loads of different things like that. So we're going to go and do the mechanic route. I will, however, show you one alternate route at the end of the kind of episode. I sort of like cut to the final thing so you can sort of see how the last bit plays out. But for the time being, let's uh, go with this. Look, we really have to do this, all things considered. We're putting a pasty-faced egghead inside a Mach 3 fighter jet. Yeah, I kind of think we do. <sighs> I get it, I get it. Safety first and all that. I don't care which one of you does it, it's mandatory. Just tick the box and get it done. Cool. Yes, we're gonna track this Escape one. Escape by fighter jet. Sounds dangerous. Yes, yes, yes. Basically, the chess master here wants to go and get out by a plane. And the mechanics need to do some um, some tests beforehand, and they also need to get him to sit in the actual plane and test him. Like, make sure it's all safe before the actual kind of thing plays out. So, we're going to go and tamper with that, basically. Got some coins. Right, where's this guard? Uh, I'm going to need to be patient for a second. Obviously, if you, if you guys are like Hitman fans as well, I am not in my suit because this is like pre-agency days. This is training in the ICA facility before I become an active agent, so... I'm still wearing my turtleneck, <laughs> turtleneck hype, to wait for that guard to turn away first. Um, otherwise, he's gonna have something to say when I go and knock the other guy out. Right, I'm gonna go and throw this coin over here. Create a distraction. Huh? Uh, hey, are you there? I heard something suspicious. I'll keep you posted. Oh no, you won't. Sorry, buddy. There are no the only thing that you're gonna keep posted. Hey! Is yourself in this box. Ha! <laughs> that doesn't even make sense, but you know what? Let's go with it. Right. Take him out. I need oh no, I need his disguise first. And then put him in the box. Perfect, right. I don't actually need the gun, I'll take it anyway, but no plan on using that. Right. Should I casually walk now? What's up, buddy? Next job is to get the mechanic uniform. So for that, let's go inside here. This uniform I've got now is pretty good because on the base floor, no one's really going to ask me any questions. Uh, when I go upstairs, the or like they won't let me go upstairs, so Cuba. it's only it's good only for a, for a little bit. But if I was night, around I here, what's up, buddy? Sorry, I need your uniform. 
And I don't think you want to like openly let me have it, so. Like that. And then we will go and whack him in there. Sleep tight. I haven't killed anyone by the way. I'm all about that silent life, so I'm only gonna kill the target. Uh, right. Now I do need to be careful here because the guys by the jet, the other workmen, they do actually well they will suspect me, so I need to be careful with that one. Um examine safety protocol. Jasper Knight certainly knows how to make an exit. But first, he needs to test the jet's safety equipment, including the ejector seat. Ha. Huh. Oh, no. Sorry. No thanks, buddy. I need to get a wrench. That's the one thing I am uh, forgot off the top of my head. Where is the wrench? I'll find it. No, don't look at me, please. Oh, I think I know where it is. I think. So. So I can just get around here. Nothing to see here, buddy. You pay attention to the jet. That'd be really nice. No, 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 no. Sorry. Can you turn around? That would be really nice. Oh, there it is. There's the wrench. That's what I was looking after. Oh, no, it's not. That's a, that's a bar. Um. Give me a second. I need to go and do some, some searching. There was me like, I know exactly how to do this. And I do. I know what I need to do. I just need to remember. There it is. I found it. Perfect. I'm going to hide for a second. Whoopsie. Alright, you drink your coffee. Come on. Have you got work to be doing, mister? Go back to work. Good. I'll have that. I'll hide that for now, just in case. And then... We quickly go this way. Now I need to tamper with the engine, or the... Um, ejector seat functionality, and that will be good. You, oh no, no, no! You're 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 busy. There we go. All right, you hurry up. Yeah, cool. All right, quickly. Let's have with that. The trap is now set. Now fetch Jasper Knight and guide him through the procedure. Checklist is on the clipboard. Well okay, done, thank you. Initiate. I dare say this is an accident waiting to happen. <laughs> oh yes, it is. Right, let's try and get up the oh, stairs quickly before they see. Now we need to go and find the scientists and basically say, "Hey, buddy, it's time to uh, time to check that everything works safely." I'm just going that way because the guy was about to see me. Is he? I'm going to cut through here actually. That will avoid so Soviet ambassador. Avoid detection. He was one of Janice's people. Mm-hmm. Man of peace, voice of reason. Cool. Alright. Quintessential good rush. Is he still in here? Let's have a look. Yes he is, targets in there. Aha. Hey Grease Monk. Jasper Knight. We gotta go over the safety protocol. Follow me, please. Oh, must we really? Yes, yes we must. Now come along, let's go. Be a good chap. Right. Let's um, hopefully the guys won't see us down there. So this guy might know I mean, think about it. Janus really is. Oh, don't see me. No, no, no. Thank you. I'm just gonna run around here. This guy will follow me, but it's alright. As you said, best kind of spy. Right. I'm gonna go. Quickly around the other side to the clipboard, and we should be good. Once he actually bothers to catch up, 
You coming? Come along. I don't have all day. Thank you. Hi there. Right. Okay, Mr. Knight. Climb in the cockpit, please. Uh-huh. All right. Easy. One. One step at a time. Step one, strap yourself in. Uh, okay, all strapped in. Step two, locate the ejector seat handle. Uh, just a moment. Uh, yes, found it. Step three, pull the ejector seat handle. <laughs> uh, right. Here it goes. Pull. Yep, now I'm just going to casually walk out of here because... Oh my god, did that just happen? Oh my god, yes it did happen. But I... I'm just going to casually roll out. Nothing to see here, guys. Surely you think after all that they'd be like, wait, who is responsible for this? But apparently not. Oh. And I am out. There we go. So that's the kind of solution. Congratulations, agent. You are cleared for field duty. I hope you know what you just did. The chopper leaves at dawn. Now get out of my sight. So what happens now? You go back into the world, disappear, stay on your own and on the move. When we need you, we will contact you. And so does. He played his hand and he lost. He cannot touch us now. <laughs> Still, I can't believe we beat him at his own game. If you know your enemy. <laughs> Quite right. I should tell you, the trail went dead after Romania. Our team found no records of any kind. No name. Nothing. I think they called me 47. That's not a name. So make it one. All right. Agent... 47. Now just before I wrap up this episode as sort of like a bonus option, this is a different way to do it. If you uh, actually dress up as the KGB guy, he goes to the toilet in this back room and you can then knock him out and take his uniform. If you then have the vodka and you put it on the desk and you then poison the glasses with rat poison, you then want to go over to the chessboard and tamper with it because bear in mind he's a chess champion so he's going to get a little bit annoyed. But if you solve it by moving the queen to G3, he'll then come over and say, excuse me. Get your hands off my chessboard. Like that. And then once he realizes that we've actually wow, solved his KGB. puzzle. Really? Yes. Just the move I was contemplating. I appreciate the gesture, friend, but one genius is more than enough. Why on earth didn't I think of that? <laughs> He'll now come over here and have a drink. He actually drinks from the left glass, so you only actually need to poison the left glass, but if you're ah, unsure the fabled vodka. you can find well two. Uh, sets of poison the level so you can poison both left and right glasses and once he drinks the rat poison he'll then want to go to the toilet so i'm going to go and pre-enter the toilet to get rid of his for his arrival i'm gonna hide in here no actually you know what i don't even need to hide in here exit out here this is also where you can get the kgb officer he comes into this room to go to the toilet, so you can then... Actually, he doesn't go to the toilet, he goes to the mirror, and you can then strangle him. So he comes in, close the door quickly, and then we will go and drown him. No, I didn't mean to do that, I did that again. Did the same thing last time. And then there you go. And you can either leave him there, or again, you can just pick him up. And, uh, 
throw in the box and that's it and then of course after that you then have to get out of the level again but you guys have seen that already so that is it that was just a bonus kind of like additional way to kill it but do bear in mind if you look at the challenges there are loads of ways to do it for example you can rig the projector so that he electrocutes himself um, you can actually go in and try and sort of do it without using any disguises you can drop a light on his head there's loads of stuff you can do but for the time being, that was a look at a couple of different ways to do it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, then again, smash that like button. It would be super appreciated. Comment down below and let me know if you guys want to see more. Of course, the beta only has limited things you can do right now. But once the full game does come out, I do plan on doing some more of this. And of course, it's an episodic game, meaning there will be releases throughout the year. So there will be lots more chances to do some more Hitman content. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take it easy. Catch you next time. Peace out.